Hello, tankers! As promised, let's discuss the most important news of the past weeks, of which the first has to be the early access to the brand new Scorpion turret during this Ultra Weekend. From June 24th till the 26th, we will have one more festive weekend. We never get tired of packing special offers for you, and a few more will appear in the shop's showcase. And for those who prefer getting cool new items to play with in matchmaking battles, we will add even more special missions to complete. Did you enjoy playing with the B0NK in the event last weekend? From what we saw, you did. So this weekend, we're giving you another opportunity to play with this legendary turret and scorpion in the arms race mode. You heard right. There's another chance for everyone to check out the new turret. Before we announced it, we made a few posts on our social media pages, and many of you thought it was just a new HD skin for Shaft or Magnum. Now you know for sure. This is something totally new. The turret called Scorpion first appeared in the arms race event mode two weeks ago, and starting from today, it is in the early access stage. You can get it from the updated Ultra containers. Moreover, we have already added augments for it. Those who do not have the turret itself can still get the following augments from regular containers. Explosive shells that add splash damage to arcade shots. Explosive warheads that add splash damage to rockets. And missile launcher Wolfpack that changes how the rockets fly. Lucky owners of the Scorpion turret can just buy these augments in the garage for crystals. Let us remind you how the turret works. It has two shooting modes. The first is created for short-range combat. Arcade shots are like a combination of Railgun and Smokey. The very long barrel lets Scorpion projectiles reach extremely high velocity, hitting the enemy with lightning speed. The second mode is meant for punishing campers at long distances. It uses two rocket launchers and starts locking on like Striker or Juggernaut. Once launched, projectiles rush up into the sky. Your opponent may not even suspect anything until a hail of 10 missiles rains down upon them. Of course, it's not all that simple. Scorpion is quite a skillful turret. It is worth playing with it several times to feel and understand the mechanics of the projectile flight and reload timings. If an opponent notices the approaching salvo of rockets in time, they will be able to hide from it. We will also release a protection module that will help protect your armor against Scorpion damage, called Vulture. Of course, you can get it for crystals in the garage. Leave your questions about Scorpion in the comments, and we will make sure to answer them in future episodes of the vlog. The first major tournament of this year is in full swing. 16 teams are fighting for places in the Legends stage, and exactly half of them will advance to join the 8 highest rated teams from previous tournaments. This tournament differs from all previous ones not only because of the cash prize of 380,000 rubles for the best teams, but also by the large number of activities we have prepared for our viewers. On each livestream, we will show a promo code that gives each viewer one Ultra Container. Moreover, we will soon announce a new eSports tanky fund, in which players will have the opportunity to earn very valuable prizes for completing each level, as well as the chance of receiving some tank coins from the fund. Don't miss the live streams of our eSports matches. During the Challenger stage, they will take place on our YouTube channel and then on our new Twitch channels. Root for your favorite teams, watch interesting games, and earn cool rewards. If you want to know more about the tournament, Follow the link in the description. The updated pro battles are already in the game. Finally, that annoying window warning you about not being able to earn crystals and experience has disappeared. Now there are multiple formats where you can play and earn rewards. And don't forget that premium owners can get even more. Let's start with the classic format, which definitely brings back nostalgia for older versions of Tanky. Another mode for experienced tankers is Railgun Masters. Those who really love the turret will enjoy it. There's also a sport format for those who prefer to play on an equal footing, as equipment used in this mode is automatically upgraded to the maximum modification. The only exception is parkour mode, so you still can't get rewards there. Choose your favorite mode and create battles with your rules. Your experiences and reviews are very important to us now. Don't forget to leave a comment, so we know what to fix and improve.
Welcome back to YouTuber Digest, our weekly selection of the best TO videos created by players. With one of the most recent updates, we saw the much-anticipated Shaft Legacy skin added to the game. It can be obtained by completing the recent battle pass. Check out Ufa showing off this awesome new skin in his epic kill montage. This next video brings a slightly different flavor. The recent Ultra Weekend saw the addition of a cool new mode. Players were chasing each other around on the remastered sandbox map with the B0 NK turret. One of our YouTubers, Taspens, made a cool montage and also shared a few gameplay tips whilst he was raking in those kills. Enjoy! Everyone piling to the same goal. That would be dope. Come on, baby! Let's go! This event's fun. I like it. Jeez! No way! <laughs> I'm getting flung through the air, man! Quick reminder, if you want your video to be featured in the next episode of the vlog, submit your entries to the YouTuber wannabe form, which can be found in the video's description. Maybe you will surprise us with one of your videos. Last time, you had to guess how many tanks were hidden on the map. The correct answer is 9 tanks. Congratulations to the winners! And here is the next question. That's all for this episode. Smash the like button if you're happy that the vlog is back. Don't forget to share your achievements, ask questions, and talk to other players in the comments. We appreciate it. See you next Friday. Bye.